cars here are really chaotic like they drive fast they're always trying to impress people they're making so much noise you probably can hear them now it's just like it's really big traffic over here like right on the road on the boulevard is so bad there's a lot of cars coming by every five seconds this and this and that whatever <laughs> It's your girl Sammy and we back with another video in the house. Period. Hey guys, my name is Samantha. If you're new to my channel, welcome. So today's video will be like a kind of college tips slash um about Rowan University. If you guys are thinking about going there either in the spring or next year and kind of like how everything goes and like just everything about college and how's college like for me and if you guys should go to Rowan University so yeah so if you're new to my channel why not go hit the subscribe button because we're dropping a lot of college videos soon I just been slacking with the whole YouTube thing but you know if you guys like college videos in general just subscribe to my channel and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and like and drop a comment so yeah let's just get right into this video okay, so where is U Rowan University Rowan University is in Glassboro New Jersey um from me it's like 45 to 50 minute drive so from you guys I don't know it just all depends some people is farther away some people is closer so yeah um some facts about Rowan University um if you don't like parties don't come here like this is a really big party slash frat school um there's always parties on the weekends there's always frats there's always kappas and like all this other stuff so so yeah if you don't like parties don't come here but then again you're not coming to school to party so like you know you know you can still come here just don't go to the parties you know but there's always something happening either outside i stay in holly point holly point is the newest buildings on campus where you can stay in um other other ones are like farther away um but those other like dorms they're like older so like they're like from 19 i don't know 60 80s so it's really hot in there there's no air conditioner there's no elevator there's only stairs but Holly Point, we have elevators, we have stairs, we have a dining downstairs. So if that's what you're into, try to, you know, but they're gonna, the college is gonna pick you, like, your, where you stay in the first year, I believe. So, I just got lucky to be in Holly Point. Um, but like I was saying, if you're not really a big party person, I don't think this is the school for you. But then again, you don't come to school to party, so... But if you like lit parties and you know getting to know people why not go they're always on the weekends um if you stay in holly point all the classes are gonna be a farther walk so for me all my classes are between a four to 15 minute walk the only one that's four minutes is one of my classes i have like six classes so only one of my classes is like four minutes which is literally on a boulevard so I'm lucky to have that class. It's an 8 o'clock class too. So, you know, I have that tomorrow actually. First thing. But, you know, the walks are long. Like, if you stay in Holly Point, 10. Get ready to be walking 10 to 15 minutes every day. Like, yeah. If you stay in the, like, the older dorms, it's much closer. So it's not a, as a far walk, you know. But, yeah. Um, another fact about Rowan, it's, it's one of the biggest, like, not biggest, it's one of the top schools in New Jersey. So if you stay in New Jersey, just look into it. Um, it's a really good school. It's like, it's quiet most of the time. Um, I would say it's safe a little bit, but there's always something going on with these parties. They're always getting shut down, always getting chaos and like fights and stuff. So, is it safe? Kind of like a 50 percent you know but it's not that bad then the police are just doing their job you know but yeah the dorms are nice um 
you have your own for showers if you guys like look into shower stuff um women's have their own shower and there's also a all gender shower so if you don't mind showering with like boys girls or like trans or anything like that then there's the all gender showers but there's also a woman and a men's shower only so if you don't like showering with other people just your gender there's a shower for you um the shower for me is like literally five second walk from my dorms like really right there same with the toilets there's an all gender toilet there's a all um there's a woman toilet and there's a men toilet so yeah you know we respect all genders here so if you're a type of person that's like you know lgbtq and like you know you don't think it's lgbtq friendly it is we respect everybody here like we're all family um so the boulevard we have a boulevard it's like really right here i stay in holly so it's like really down the street um there's a lot of restaurants there Domino's. there's a yoga factory there's 7-eleven there's a salon there's a, a lot of cafes and mexican grills and like apartments they're all on the boulevard so which is good because it's literally all right there you want to get your nails done it's right there you want to get food it's right there you know it's just a vibe um the cars here are really chaotic like they drive fast they're always trying to impress people they've been making so much noise you probably can hear them now just like it's really big traffic over here like right on the road on the boulevard is so bad and there's a lot of cars coming by every five seconds this and this and that whatever um so yeah, rowing is really good school though. So if you're really thinking about going there or transferring, I suggest you do it because it's really good school. Um, privacy, you get your privacy. There's a lot of lounge, like on every floor there's a lounge or in Holly Point. There's a um, lounge there like on every floor. So if you want to chill by yourself or chill with your friends or study, like it's really good. Like there's lounges like everywhere here. So if you're a really big study person or want privacy there's a place for you um the dining let's talk about the food the dining is good but if you have your wrong card so you get a wrong card so make sure you guys like do your picture and stuff like that for your card but like there's two separate categories for your wrong card is actually three to get into your room of course um, there's a dining bugs and there's no there's dining there's a meal plan and there's um wrong bugs so like for if you're going downstairs and you want to use your dining um it's all access so you just swipe your card on the thing and you can eat whatever you want like there's literally any type of food downstairs in the dining like there's pizza tater tots chicken breakfast section lunch section they they just have anything any type of food like there's different like booths in there so you can get whatever you want um you can get how much you want it don't matter so that's a good thing um i don't really eat there often though like maybe like once a week i don't really eat like that eat there like that i usually go like to the um on a boulevard and just pick something up or order from grub pub or chick-fil-a or something like that but yeah don't use your rolling bucks or your dining bucks too much because like it is a semester thing so if you want the all access one then i suggest you do that for you like a big person that like like food and want food 24 7 then get the all access one but i have like the 14p plans something something like that but yeah um let's talk about my my college life like how i think it is um at first it was good it was really good but now it's getting stressful a little bit um you're not with your family there's a lot of times you're not gonna be with your friends and it's just like kind of stressful and then on top of that you got homework you got tests to do you got you just got to keep up with everything make sure you have a planner like i suggest you get a planner or write everything on your phone because there's a lot of stuff that you're gonna have to do in college and you're gonna have to make time for that stuff friends family homework you time sleep time make sure you eat like there's just a lot of things you have to put in your planner and a lot of times you're not gonna be with your friends like i'm sorry but like if you're a big person that likes to be with your friends 24 7 i don't think that's gonna happen because 
yeah making friends are cool hanging out with them are cool but you have to get your school stuff prioritized first before anything and i feel like me i'm like slacking a little bit with the hanging out with friends thing because like i like to be by myself sometimes most of the time so i'm trying to get my work done i'm trying to do this it's just a lot of, there's just a lot of stress going on depression sometimes you know but overall college is good it's looking good everybody here is so nice they will say hi to you they will smile at you open the door for you like it's just it's just a vibe here like people are so friendly i don't think I haven't met anybody that's like really mean or anything like everybody here is like so nice there's diversity so if you're looking like if you're scared like it's not diverse it's really diverse school there's all types of nationalities and people culture it's just it's just a vibe there's a lot of clubs clubs oh my gosh make sure you join the club I joined ballroom dance um I haven't went though but definitely going tomorrow it's from like 8 to 8 45 on like the dance studio which is a 13 minute walk from here so there's that but there's like more than 150 clubs join a club join a few actually there's a lot of sports clubs any type of clubs like there's a hockey club a pin club a human service club a women's club lgbtq club i mean, there's everything here there's a lot of clubs and there's a lot of organizations, there's a lot of stuff at the student center, the Chamberlain Center. They're always doing something on campus. So make sure you like check your emails, check the website. They're always doing something. Like this school is just a vibe, like it's just a vibe in general. So yeah, that's basically it for this video. I know I was talking a lot, but I hope I give you guys a lot of information. Um so yeah, if you're thinking about coming, coming to Rowan, make sure you come. Like, it's just a vibe. I'm going to meet you guys. I want to meet everybody that's thinking about coming. And if you have any questions for me, just drop them in the comments. Um, I hope you guys liked this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.